Hey guys, welcome. <laughs> oh, I need this phone. <laughs> If anyone has dry lips, I'm telling you, this stuff works. It's like macadamia, something or other, <laughs> but it works really good. That is not sponsored, by the way. Oh, a bit too much. Oh, I can taste that. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and another video. So today's video is all about planning June. Did you say that? <laughs> I know it's like the 4th of June already, but uh... You know, better late than never. This can sort of help you out as well if you're trying to figure out what you want to do for the month of June. And at the end, I've got some questions to ask you that you can answer to try and figure out what you're going to do for June. Uh, this is not a bullet journal. I am in no way an artist and I would struggle to create a really beautiful bullet journal for each month. So that's not what this is. It's just me talking about what I'm going to be doing this month. Sort of like planning with you guys and gals. Let's get straight into it. For real this time, I'm going to keep this one short and sweet, so let's start. <laughs> Why am I so cold? I swear, if I was an animal, I think I'd be like a grizzly bear or something that hibernates in like a warm, cozy cave with their belly full of food and they just sleep. That would definitely be me because I'm so cold all the time. I would 100% be a grizzly bear, I think. Anyone else? What's your spirit animal? Comment below. <laughs> or maybe like a sloth, because I'm so slow. Why the hell don't humans hibernate? Okay, so let's get started. So my goals for June, my pri let's first talk about my primary goals for June. First one on the list is to exercise more, because I have been slacking, especially with the weather getting this cold, or getting colder. It's actually a beautiful day today. I'm looking at the sun out there like, today would be a good day for some exercise. <laughs> It's getting much colder and when it gets colder I lack the motivation to get outside and exercise so I need to do more of that. That's one of my big goals this month is to exercise at least three times a week. I think gyms are set to open back up on like the 14th of June or something at least where I live so that should hopefully help me get some more exercise in which would be awesome. Not only exercise though I've been eating a lot of chocolate. I always eat so much chocolate in winter I don't know why but eating so much chocolate and like other bad food that I need to stop eating so I need to eat cleaner as well is yeah I've been eating a lot of chocolate <laughs> so that's my first goal the next goal is to pretty much just get up earlier which I have been doing over the past few days I've been getting up slowly getting up earlier each day which will lead me to my next point in a second and also going to bed earlier pretty much so I can get up earlier that's just common sense but yeah and my next point is to start streaming again I mentioned this in my last video 101 of my favorite things that I will be streaming again and I will be it's 100% gonna happen I just don't know what exact day I'm gonna start doing it yet and the schedule probably won't be like fixed it'll vary a lot still I play World of Warcraft so frequently that it's like why not just stream it but the problem is I play it a lot at night time when like my family's going to bed and stuff so I can't really stream because it'll be I'll be too loud so I have to like do it in the morning instead or do it wake up earlier finish work earlier and then stream like how I was doing it before if any of you watched me that is another goal for June is to stream again the goal for this is it's literally just to start not really any fixed schedule just to bloody start again and just get me back into it because I think there's potential there for me streaming I really enjoyed it I think it really helped me cope with a lot of my anxiety and I really I really just enjoy it like talking to people while I play games so speaking of streaming you can also comment down below what platform you think I should stream on Facebook YouTube Twitch or Mixer because I'm sort of thinking of moving from Mixer but I don't know I will be starting streaming again this month at some point. Like I said in the last video, keep an eye out on my Instagram. That's probably where I'll post like when I'm going to do it and stuff. So yeah. One of my other goals is, so I currently have a dog blog and I want to, I'm not going to give away any details, but pretty much I just want to say it. So I, re I remember it when I look back on this video. Um, it's to set up something for that dog blog, something special. So uh, that's another thing I need to do and maybe saying this in the video maybe hold me to it so let's hope so tell me this doesn't look good right <laughs> so 
So the final primary goal I have for June, I want to create better Instagram pictures for my feed. So right now they're kind of like all over the place, random stuff. Like I've always wanted like a cohesive aesthetic, like an Instagram feed. Like I've always wanted that, you know, you see like one might be like a, a like a beige color scheme with like lots of bright whites and I think it works better when you have like the house to match, which I don't really, but I just sort of want to create something like that or like dark and moody. I haven't really decided on one yet, but I really want to create something like that because right now I just have a shit Instagram feed. And that's another thing I want to work on is creating also like better Instagram photos, like just getting more creative and stop like slacking in like how I make photos and I've been looking up like a lot of inspiration on like Pinterest. Stay tuned, hopefully the Instagram feed will look a little bit better in the coming days or weeks or or months. <laughs> Lip balm really did some magic to my lips. <laughs> Why do you guys watch me? I'm so lame. Okay, now this is an optional possibility for June. I'm not saying it's gonna happen, but it's optional. Like if I've got spare time or if like I just really feel like doing it, I'm just gonna put it out here though to remind myself as I do, is to start writing and working on my creative book again. I find it so hard to keep motivated to writing like after I finish work, because my job is to write, so I find it hard to want to do it as like a side hobby. That's something else I can work on is my creative book. Also, a couple of other optional possibilities is to start my mental health blog. I've always wanted to start a mental health blog and start writing a book for that blog as well. But they're all like, like I just don't have the time. It's so frustrating. It's like I've got to choose one thing over the other. Do I do video game streams or do I start working on my mental health blog? Do I start working on... Oh, it's just... Oh, priorities. What is a priority right now? Do I stream? If you really want me to stream again, comment below. <laughs> so now that I've discussed my primary goals for the month of June, let's hope I get them in action and do them. You guys are holding me accountable for doing them. All right, thank you. Let's talk about the stuff I wanna obviously regularly keep on doing for June, which I normally do and make sure I don't stop doing them. The first one is of course to continue uploading to my dog blog. I used to work with dogs and cats and I have a certificate two and three in animal studies, which is why I know so much like about dogs and that, which is why I created a blog on dogs. So that's why, but I'm not gonna share what it is just yet, like what the name of it is. So regularly upload to my dog blog, which I'm doing once a week at the moment. The thing I wanna do is though, try and plan it better for each week because right now, like I'm rushing to get it done on the day I need to upload. So I'm thinking of sort of doing it in advance if I've got spare time, create it in advance and then just be able to publish, publish it straight away on the day instead of like running around like, oh, I need to do this, need to do that. Just gonna make, just gonna make my life a lot easier. We all need that, don't we? Obviously, another regular thing to do is continue uploading YouTube videos, which I'm finding really hard to do, by the way. <laughs> editing takes so long and with, like work and everything, it's, it's just so hard to keep on top of it. Oh my goodness. You've probably noticed that I started by uploading videos on Wednesday, then it went to Thursday, then it went to Friday, then I think the last one I uploaded was on Saturday, which is why in my bio I've written that I upload weekly and not a, on a particular day because I'm so shit at sticking to a schedule. <laughs> Which I am sorry for, but that's what you get if you watch me. <laughs> so right now I'm sort of like filming on Wednesday or Thursday, then editing on like Friday and uploading like Friday or Saturday. So that's probably going to keep changing a lot. So there's not much I can do about that because the shit just gets in the way. Of course, I'm going to continue working as I normally do as a freelancer, work, 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 and regularly, regularly keep drinking lots of water. It is amazing how much, how good that is for your health. And I've been doing all right with it ever since it was one of my New Year's resolutions to drink more water. Uh, been doing all right with it, but I just want to obviously keep making sure I drink lots of water every single day. Especially in winter when you don't really get thirsty because it's not hot. It makes it even harder. And those are my goals for June. I wanted to make this a little bit interactive though at the end by asking you guys some questions. These are questions that you can one, either answer in the comments, two, you can answer in like your head or write down your answer in a journal for example or number three you can do both you can write them down and let me know in the comments so we can sort of like chat 
with each other and keep each other motivated for the month of June. Yay! Because June does mark the middle of the year, so... Oh my god, I can't believe it's already the middle of the year. Is this year going like extremely fast for anyone else or is it just me? Because despite like the pandemic and everything, things are still going so quickly for me. So I don't know. Okay, so here are my questions. Number one, what are your three primary goals for June? That my three are exercise three times a week, start streaming again. And probably to wake up earlier. Number two, how do you want this month to be different from the previous month? What do you want to improve? Um, what went wrong in that month that you want to make right in this month? Like all that kind of stuff. Number three, what are you going to do, change or learn to reach those goals for this month? Question number four is, do you want this month to be more of a rest and repair month? Or is it going to be more of like a work hard, hustle type of month and why we all need those type of rest periods like if we need to recover from a difficult situation mentally or physically um, it's always good to do that but that's my question to you is that is this month going to be sort of like a rest and relaxation month or is it going to be like a work hard get shit done month <laughs> for me it's going to be option number two <laughs> that would be the rubbish truck splendid thank you mr bin man but could you hurry up Oh my god. I just realized that entire time I was filming, I had the mic sitting on top of my camera and it wasn't plugged in. <laughs> I had sat it on there and I didn't plug it in yet and this whole time I'm filming it's just dangling out and I didn't even notice. <laughs> oh, why do these things happen to me? <laughs> Alright, moving on. So question number five. Are your plans for this month balanced? So maybe one of your plans is like, I'm going to binge watch this series on Netflix or something like that. Are you balancing that with getting outdoors, getting some sun and exercising? So like ask yourself that question as well. Same as if like your plan is to work really hard and get this project finished, are you also balancing it with enough sleep? Question number six is if you could accomplish one major thing this month, what would it be? And this could be anything. Like if maybe your one major thing is to drink three liters of water every day, do a workout every single day. For example, like what's one major thing you want to accomplish? And my last question, question number seven is, if you could ask for help this month with one thing, what would it be? And again, this could be anything. If you could ask for help with setting up an exercise routine or writing a resume or asking for help with how to edit a video. I don't know, it could be anything again, but just something to ask yourself as well. After you answer that question, ask yourself like, if you need that help, how can you get it? How can you go about getting it? Or maybe think about whether you don't really need the help and you, you're telling yourself that you feel like you need to rely on something to get it done when maybe you don't. Sort of, that's sort of where I'm going with that question. <laughs> Why does this like always hang out to the side of my whatever? So comment your answers below if you want, optional, um, or write them down or do both. Like I said, let's just help each other out with this month. Make sure this month is a good one, a productive one, and that it helps you reach your goals for the month. <sighs> oh dear. These bin trucks. This is the second one. <laughs> sure to like and comment and subscribe. Also be sure to follow me on Instagram if you want. Also looking at what I can next buy to try on and review. So also let me know what you'd like to see. And I will see you guys all in my next video. Thank you and bye. Goodbye. <laughs>